Hey everyone! So last month I decided that I finally wanted to subscribe to one of those monthly subscription services that just sends you fun things in the mail. So I decided to choose Ipsy. If you don't know what Ipsy is, you basically pay $10 a month and they send you a bunch of different makeup samples and a really cute bag and it's all personalized. So you take a quiz and they try to base each sample on what you like and how you look and things like that. So it's really cool. And I just got my first bag. It's super cute. It is pink for Valentine's Day. And I'm going to show you guys what's inside and how I like each product. The first thing I got is this brush. It is a large um, angled brush is what it's called. And it is by the brand Luxie. Look, it's my roommate. Hey. Okay. I don't really use foundation that much, so I wasn't quite sure what to do with this, but I just tried um, using my powder with it, and it worked really nice. The bristles are super soft. Chris, do you agree the bristles are super soft, right? They're so soft. It's not something I would probably buy on my own just because I don't use foundation, but if you are in a foundation, definitely recommend it. It was soft, it did the job. Um, yeah. The second thing I got is this blush. Can you tell it's a blush? It's not obvious or anything. It is by the brand Cosmopolitan and it is in the color... Oh no! It is by the brand Model Co. And it is the the uh, color Cosmopolitan. So it's basically this really nice like pink. I'll let you see that. I'm actually wearing it on my cheeks right now if you can see. It's definitely not my favorite blush. I have Tarte blush and it's my absolute favorite so it doesn't quite compare to that but I thought it did a really good job. It's pretty pigmented. The powder came off really nicely onto my brush. It went on really nicely onto my cheeks. It lasted a pretty decent amount of time so definitely a nice thing to add to my collection. Not my favorite but I do enjoy it. The third product I got is this lip gloss from Cargo Cosmetics and it is in the color Anguilla. I can't pronounce that, but it's just this really nice pink color. I'm also wearing it on my lips. I kind of laughed when I opened this because I have lip gloss in this color already. I have at least like two things of lip gloss in this color, so the quiz really worked. They they got me. Thank you. Ipsy, you nailed it. As far as the actual lip gloss goes, the first time I tried it, I really liked it. It has a really nice consistency. It went on pretty smoothly. But then I tried it again before I made this video and my lips were chapped and it didn't quite go on the same. It kind of looks inconsistent. So, um, wasn't crazy about that, but for the most part I'm happy with it. It came in a $10 bag, so I'll definitely use it in the future. I don't know if I would recommend it over other brands, but I definitely enjoyed it, and the color is fantastic. I love it. Okay, so the fourth product I got is this NYX Crystal Shimmer uh, Eye Pencil, which looks like this. And I was really excited to get this because I already love NYX as a brand, and I hadn't tried their eyeliner yet, so I was really excited. I was just a little thrown off by the color. As you can see, it is just like a shimmery white color. It's basically just a sparkle pencil, so I wasn't quite sure what I was going to do with it. So what I did before this was I put it in the corner of my eye, like my inner corner, and then I also put it under my lower lashes to um, kind of make my black eyeliner that I wear on my waterline a little more sparkly. And I kind of like the way it looks. I don't think it's something I'm going to do every day, but it's like a fun product to have, something I wouldn't have bought on my own, but I'm kind of glad I got in something like this. That's why I subscribed to this, to get things I wouldn't necessarily buy on my own and to try new things, so this is definitely a really nice thing. And I know NYX is pretty cheap product-wise, so if you're looking for something fun and sparkly, definitely try this out. And then the last product I got is this Glam Glow Bright Mud Eye Treatment, and I, they actually sent me two. I don't know if that was on purpose or not. I haven't actually tried them yet. Me and my roommate are gonna have spa night, and we're both gonna try these, so I will cut to that and let you know what we think. Okay, so we're finally trying the eye treatment. This is Glam Glow Bright Mud Eye Treatment, again. Um, so it's under my eyes right now, as you can see. It kind of tingles and it kind of stings. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll see how it goes. My roommate's trying it too, so do you yeah. want to be on camera? Okay. Hey, Christy. Hey. Yeah, so we'll see how this goes. We have to take it off in three minutes. So three minutes passed, I took it off. I actually think it worked pretty well. Like, I don't have any bags under my eyes, and I definitely should because I did not get much sleep last night. Uh, so my only issue was that it stung while it was on pretty much the entire time, so it was a little uncomfortable. I don't know if that's normal or if like it's something that you'll adapt to as you wear it more, but like it did its job. Like I don't have bags under my eyes, so I'd say like if that's a problem for you, and it's something you really are self-conscious about, definitely try this product, uh, but definitely not my favorite that came in the bag today. Any words, Christy? I second that nomination. My eyes are really sticking right now, and I feel kind of sickly, so... Yeah, so... <laughs>
Okay, so that was my Ipsy glam bag for the month of February. If you are interested in subscribing to Ipsy, I will leave my referral link in the description box. You can click it. I definitely recommend it. It was really fun getting a surprise in the mail with makeup. I like makeup. And yeah, it's just kind of like a fun thing to do and $10 really isn't that much. So I definitely recommend it. So that is all I have for now, but I will see you next month when I get my new bag. Bye!